Hello everyone, expat Ian in the Philippines. So with this video, I just want to talk quickly about um, online shopping in the Philippines, um, especially uh, with uh, Lazada and Shopee. So uh, why do we order online? Because it's very convenient for us. So we don't have to go uh, driving around, uh, looking in shops and whatever. It's all uh, either on the internet or on your cell phone, the, the apps. So you can just go through, um, check what you want, uh, click on it. And uh, you can either do like cash on delivery or you can uh, like make a, a, a wallet, they call it. Put money in there, and uh, you can pay pay with that. Or there's other ones also, G Cash and stuff like this. We normally do cash on delivery. Um, yeah, you order, uh, and then sometimes uh, they're there the next day, already depending on where it's coming from, which is another thing I want to talk about. Um, well, I'll, I'll tell you now. If possible, when you're ordering, check that it's uh, from the Philippines, that the order is coming from the Philippines. Um, many of the products are from China. So uh, when you order, it, firstly, it will take longer. And you think, with my experience, uh, a lot of the things were not correct. So either too small or didn't work. So what happens is uh, a few years ago, you had to send that back. Now, if um, if you can prove that it's either too small or broken, you have to take uh, photos and videos and you have to send that to them and they um, you'll get your money back, but you don't have to return the product, which has happened to me a couple of times. But it's still uh, a bit annoying. And the other thing is, if you order clothing from China, they're far, far too small. <laughs> they, uh, like I, I'm, I'm a, a X, XL, a three XL or four XL, and you know, I, um, I wanted to order something. Yep, yeah, from China, four XL. Well, I've got, I can't even. <laughs> it's 4XL Chinese size for the little Chinese. So uh, for our size, it would be then like six or seven X. <laughs> so that's the problem that you will have if you order from um, if you order from China. So I'm doing this video because I had. Um, the last two weeks, two um, unsatisfactory um, orders. Uh, if you guys had, had seen my video about the battery for my laptop, which is now working fine, that, that was up. But the first battery I ordered, uh, this was on Shopee. Um, uh, on the app, it, it said, so there's a photo and a description, HP was on, on the battery and showed the battery and it looked exactly the same as mine. I even asked the seller, because you can chat with them, yes, 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 no problem, yes, yes, yes. So I I ordered it, and it's original HP battery, blah, 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 blah. So it got it the next day. I thought, wow, that was, that was quick. So it got here the next day. I uh, un unpacked it and straight away when I see it, I thought, uh, the, the writing on the front is, looks different already. And the, the HP sign wasn't on it, which means it's not original. So because I had already had my original out of my laptop to, to look, 
I could see already on the on the socket the connection from the battery to the um, there was ten pins on the old one. The the new one also had a ten pin socket, but there were only actually nine pins there. So I thought, I don't know, I'll I'll try anyway. So um, put it in my laptop. Didn't work. Um, I kept on getting the message on my laptop that uh, no battery could be detected. So I got in contact with the seller. I says, look, put it in and it's not working. Oh, um, yeah, everything should be okay. And I says, well, it's not. I showed them pictures then of the connector that it's not the same. Also that it's not an original battery, which they described in the description. And then uh, the next message I got was request a refund. Oh, great. So, which I got also, uh, I got the money back that day. So then I got in contact with another seller, um, asked him also, is the battery blah, blah, blah. Yes, it's original. Ah, no, 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 no. And yes, this one will be okay for your laptop. So again, the next day it arrived and it worked. So um, yeah, it's just sometimes a, a, a pain. So that was that one. And another one was yesterday. So yes, uh, the other day, again, uh, two days ago, I ordered a microphone for when I'm doing my, my lives. And uh, on here, it says um, an up, upgraded, um, upgraded noise reduction. So it's supposed to be noise reduction and blah, blah, blah. And so apparently, um, no, I'm not going to take it out. Um, there's a button on here, which is the volume button. And when you press it in, there's like three modes. There's normal mode, and then there's the, um, um, the noise, um, how do you say it? Noise reduction mode. And then there's another one. So the light... For each one, so you have white, green, and blue. Okay, so I ordered this two days ago. It came then yesterday. Took it out, set it up, plugged it in. For, yes, no noise reduction. It um, you press the the volume button like like it said the instruction, and it doesn't change the modes. It's stuck on one one mode. So anyway, I tested it out anyway, and you can hear things through the mic, because you can put your headphones on, you can hear things through your microphone that I can't hear normally. So it, it, it's so sensitive. And because then the noise reduction didn't work, it was just I uh, the neighbours talking and the electric fans are on and the outside the cat's meowing and it was, it was crazy. So this morning, well, I got in contact with them yesterday. Uh, am I sure that I'm doing it correctly? And can I not still use it? I said, well, no, not really, no. And um, they asked me to wait till this morning, uh, which I did. I sent them a message, no answer. So I put in for a refund and five minutes later, my money was back onto my onto my wallet, and uh, with the message um, um, that um, no further action is to be taken, which means I don't have to return it. With the battery last week, I had to return that one, so they give me a, a tracking number, and I had to request a guy to pick it up, and blah 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 blah. blah. This one, nothing. So. Actually, I've got, I've got then, I've, I've got a microphone, but it's very, it's too sensitive. I don't know. So, and I've ordered the, the new one, because I my money back, ordered a new one, and it should get here maybe tomorrow or, tomorrow or in two days. So, <laughs> um, so another, uh, another, 
very funny thing happened to me. You know, uh, in the restaurants or in shops, they have these fluorescent um, mosquito killers, the long ones. It's like a box with some lamps in it. You have when the mosquitoes or flies fly. I ordered one of them. Um, Lazada. So, and actually, that came, that was from China. So it took over a week, week to get it. So I've ordered it. Yep. Okay. No problem. Yep. They give me a date. Cool. Um, cash on delivery. So when the when the delivery guy came, he it was a big big black plastic bag. Lazada written all over it. I'm going, there's, there's nothing in it. And the guy goes, yes, there is. And I goes, well, it should be a big box. You know, it's the, it, it, even on the label, it had mosquito killer. And then, so I had to pay anyway, because you, you have to pay. And then when I opened the plastic bag up, <laughs> That's no, what was no, inside. No, no. <laughs> it's a it's a ballpoint pen. <laughs> I thought, no way. So it still had description, it's mosquito killer, blah blah blah, and the price, I think it was six thousand pesos or something. And all I got was a ballpoint pen. So <laughs> I got in contact with the seller and said, one of your packing guys must be missing a pen. Because that's what that's what that's the only thing that was in the back. Nothing else. So I sent him some photos of that and the the plastic bag with a little hole. So it, so you know he could say, Oh yeah, it was in there, and you're just I said, No, look, just a little hole where I took the pen out, pen, and there, there's the, the bag, nothing in it. So that was, he says, oh, um, we're terribly sorry, we have new packing guys. And I says, yeah, but come on. I said, that's a joke, right? I says, there's supposed to be a big box in there, even the delivery guys, they, they must, it says on it, mosquito killer thing. And it ends up a pen. So, absolutely crazy. So yes, it can drive you sometimes a little bit mad doing <laughs> online shopping in the Philippines. Um, I think there's some other ones also. Sheen, I think it's called. I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, that was the... I've had a couple of other things also. Um, wooden tiles for the garden. And what they've done is Instead of lying wood on wood, they put the, the wood with the plastic uh, the, that was under. They laid it on the wood. So, of course, when they packed them 20 pieces together and it was in the, in the delivery van doing this, all but one then of the, the tiles were damaged. So, yeah, packing uh, error. I, I told that the the woman on the on the on the job. Can I not um, repair the wood, like sand it down? I said I'm paying for tiles. You know, this but new. They're supposed to be in good condition when they arrive. Oh yeah, we're very sorry. And and I said, sister, I said, do you always pack them like that? Because they should always be broken. And then I sent a photo of how they're supposed to be. Uh, oh, thank you for the. Uh, the tip and uh, are you sure you still can't use them? I said no, I can't use them. So that was again. Uh, I got my money refunded, and they're still they're still here. I still that was over a year ago, and uh, so I got to keep them. I got my money back. Yeah. So that's all with um, the. The online shopping in the Philippines. Be very careful. <laughs> it can be so, so funny. So just a quick one. 
um, subscribers. So thank you all uh, for all my loyal subscribers. I checked the analytics, of my videos, and 70% of the people that watch my videos are not subscribers. So if you are now one of the 70% that are watching the video and um, have not decided to subscribe or not, please subscribe. <laughs> please. Um, we're getting near the 1,000 now, and I'm doing like a, like a, comp it's like a competition with, a, with another channel to see who get there first. So if you haven't subscribed, please do so. It doesn't cost anything. And uh, like and, and share with uh, all your uh, family and friends. So I'll leave it at that, guys. Online shopping, be careful. I'll catch you on my next video. So from Koya Ian in the Philippines, it's goodbye. Take care, everybody.